Hi guys, uh, this one's straight from the heart and from my own personal experiences. Uh, as adults, we have uh, two aspects of our lives. One is personal and the other one professional. And which leaves us with possibly four probabilities. Uh, one wherein my personal and professional lives both are super rocking. Uh, scenario two and three where either my personal life is sinking but my professional life is rocking or my personal uh, life is rocking and my professional life is sinking but uh, in all these scenarios there is something to take care of the other but in a scenario where both my personal and professional lives are sinking that's where we're going to talk about well this might sound easier said than done but to be honest, it starts with saying this. Number one, saying it to yourself that you're the only one who can actually pull this up. Saying it to yourself that you're the only one who can actually motivate yourself to come out of this situation. And saying it to yourself that even this shall pass. Number two, start talking. Start talking to people who really matter surround yourself with the right set of people speak to people it could be it could be friends it could be colleagues it could be family it could be spouses girlfriends boyfriends it could it could just be consultants it could be your partners your bosses whoever it could be but please talk to people number three because only once you start speaking to people about things does your clouded mind starts clearing up? Number four, when you see things a little more clearer, it's easier for you, for anyone to kind of identify what makes you really, really happy. Number five, identify what you are really, really good at. This possibly is not the best time to experiment too much, so stick to your basics, stick to the core that you've built over so many years. Number six, things that make you happy and you identify that they are your core will give you a good enough reason to wake up the next day morning with tons of enthusiasm. And once you get this reason, you will never be able to sleep again. Guys, remember one thing. It's only after the first storms that you see the brightest rainbows. So possibly look at this phase, this scenario, uh, this situation in your life has come in to offer you a, a great world of opportunities. And to be very honest, there's nothing to lose. What worst can happen after this? There's really nothing to lose. The only thing that can happen is good starting this point because at this point in time either you succeed or you learn you never fail one more thing that i want to add here is that we whatever we do during this time we are a sum total of the choices that we make in our lives so believe in yourself because that's the only wisest and the best choice that you could ever make during this phase of yours. And lastly, uh, I'll leave you with two choices. One, to put up. Number two, shut up. Don't sulk, don't crib, because it's only you who could actually motivate yourself to pull out of this situation.